Hi, this is Peter from the DJ Podcast. In this video, we'll be looking at how you can create smart lists inside of Mix Vibes Cross DJ. You can use smart lists to automatically create playlists for things like different genres, BPM ranges, or release dates. This could save you tons of time that you would otherwise be spent manually creating those playlists and adding your tracks. The first thing that you need to do is go and click on this smart list playlist folder. So right click on the folder and then click create new smart list. So we'll give it a name, something like example. And then we're going to want to select whether we want to match all of the following criteria or any of the following criteria. We're going to select all to narrow down our criteria even more. So let's go ahead and start filtering out some of our tracks in this smart playlist. So we're going to go and then click on this plus button here. And then we're going to select the type of metadata that we would like to filter for. So we're going to click on this button here and that will open up the options for what kind of metadata we can filter by. So the first thing that we're going to do is first go to artist, then we're going to select contains, and then we're going to go dead mouse. Notice how it automatically updates with the tracks that only fit that criteria. Now that I've filtered down my track collection a little bit, I'm going to go ahead and add in one more criteria. For this, I'm going to go and again press the plus button. This time I'm going to change my filtering criteria to duration. Then I'm going to say is less than 7 minutes. Once I've added in that second filter, you can see that it's gone and it's only found songs that are by Dead Mouse and that are shorter than 7 minutes in length. As I said before, you can use these smart lists to automatically create these kinds of rich dynamic playlists that will automatically update each time you add new tracks to your collection. If you'd like to see more videos on Mix Vibes Cross DJ, leave a comment and let us know what you think. And don't forget to visit thedjpodcast.com for more video tutorials to improve your DJ mixes.